Hello YouTube, just want to show you my overnight stealth bag for stealth camping. This can be used as a shift bag as well, but I use it for stealth camping just uh, when I'm hiking on trails where you're not allowed to sleep. I just make my own place to, uh, to camp out. I'll show you what I bring. On the outside of the bag, I carry a few things for quick access. I got a compass. I have a first aid kit and a whistle and an easy grab away. I like to use a walking stick to get across creeks. This walking stick helps me uh, not fall in the water too often. I carry two alum aluminum water bottles. And that's it for the other side of the bag. In the first pouch, I like to carry an emergency pouch. This is basically not going to be used unless I'm in an emergency situation. But I bring it along just in case. In this pouch, I like to carry a few things for basic uh, comfort and survival. Can't have enough of these uh, hand warmers. They uh, put them in your um, armpits, in your pockets. Keeps your core nice and uh, nice and warm. This is kind of a mix and match of stuff, but I basically have um, some chocolate, some sucky candies, some soup base, some instant coffee, a chocolate bar, a hygiene kit, which is toothbrush, toothpaste, soap. I got a um, towel for uh, washing up, and I also have. Uh, some emergency candles in here as well. This is another emergency candle I made out of an old tin. It's just basically three tea lights jam packed in there. It throws off quite a bit of light. It's pretty lightweight. Got some backup batteries for all my flashlights and whatnot. I got gorilla tape wrapped around a credit card. I carry these around because uh, you can make spears out of them. They're throwing knives. Basically, uh, free knives. Got a sharp edge on them. It's time to a stick. If you need to make some sort of uh, defensive weapon. I got a uh, orange emergency poncho. If I need to be seen, wave this around and put it on. Got some contractor bags, which are great for ground sheets. Got a glow stick for signaling. And I got a nice British mirror here for signaling, of course. I got toilet paper. In this gear bag, I like to carry things that help me uh, get through my hike. I got um, got some leather gloves. I have uh, spikes for my shoes in case I'm crossing. Uh, slimy rocks or slippery surfaces. Got a headlamp and batteries. Got a gardening shovel. Pretty solid one. It's lightweight, but uh, I'd rather uh, dig a hole and then leave whatever I have to on the ground. Got a basic full tang knife. Got another flashlight. I like this one because it's got a clip on the back. I can clip it to my uh, shoulder strap. Got the Bear Grylls uh, magnesium fire starter. This, uh, you know, will come in handy if I need it. Got some backup cordage. Uh, throwing up tarps, hanging up my my um, my hammock. In the main compartment, I have to carry some backup uh, warmth. I got some wool socks, I got a face mask, I got a toque and some extra gloves. In my cook kit, I have to carry some food to eat that you don't have to cook. I got a bunch of granola bars and protein bars. And I got some smoked oysters. Got some three-in-one coffee, uh, creamer, sugar, and coffee all in, all in one package. I made a stove. 
the stove is basically uh, ultra lightweight. It's got some heavy duty foil for the base. The stove runs on fuel fuel pellets, fuel tablets. And the screen, the windscreen, is made out of the tin foil and the same aluminum uh, meshing that I bought. Boil the water up on that for your coffee. The water filtration, I got the Sawyer mini uh, filter. I got an extra, a couple extra squeeze bags and the one it came with. Also the flush system. In this bag, I like to keep uh, my sleeping arrangements, keep them nice and dry. I like to carry my Grand Trunk hammock. Got a polyurethane tarp. Got a sole emergency bivy to throw over top of my 100% wool blanket. And as for my bag itself, it wasn't an internal frame, so I decided to make one and make use of the frame. So I bought some some thin foam, which I wrapped around the Survival and Wisdom Know-How Book. It's got everything you need to know for outdoors, and it makes a great back, back, uh, back support frame for my bag. The foam itself I can throw underneath my, uh, my body on the hammock for some insulation. So everything can be used. Anyways, this is what I use for stealth hike. And, um, Thanks for watching.